You can feel the disdain right now between the game and Orton. It's intense. This match is being televised around the world in 18 languages in over 110 countries. Has the headline. 
And did you hear the impact on that kick? He hits the drop kick from an incredible vertical leap. He just planted him with a DDT. Ouch! He's really going for it now. Good Lord, what a series of strikes. Oh, Orton is so at home here in that WWE ring. The cerebral assassin showing how he is always dangerous. Don't expect a lot of mercy to be shown here. There's the clothesline. Backdrop. Orton delivered that like a shotgun blast. On a normal night, in a normal match, this might be the moment. But there's nothing normal about this. Orton controlling the head. And that series ends in deadlock. Neither one of these superstars can afford to give their opponent the upper hand. Fez Press and the fist come raining down. Never ever underestimate the sheer force behind this superstar's punches. The game into the headlock. The physicality of this match is tremendous. But is it enough to say I quit? What a battle. Breaking the will of an opponent is so much more difficult than simply injuring the body. Oh, what a painful kick. He's putting those educated feet to good use. What a sequence of punches. This match will have a lot of big moves. One question will be, who will capitalize on those moves the best? And he goes for the neckbreaker. Up the turnbuckle goes Triple H. Oh, no! Oh, we got him! I mean, there is nothing like seeing somebody go flying through the air. The kick connects. If he keeps delivering clotheslines like that, he's going to break his arm. Remember, this match will not, cannot, stop until one competitor verbally tells this entire WWE Universe. And here comes the question, do you want to quit? And he shakes it off. Again with the clothesline. And the neckbreaker connects. They're already asking. This may be too soon. Hey, you can't say I quit if there's a boot in your mouth. And there's some more emotion on display. Triple H is chipping away. And he hits the drop kick. What impact. Did you hear how his leg connected? And that's a stiff kick. That Irish grip was delivered with tremendous aggression. Squeezing down on the head. Whoa, what a drop kick! Missed him! Now, who does a methodical pace benefit, King? Well, whenever the dominating competitor... Ow! You'll be feeling that in the morning. Oh my gosh! Horton's face is just drenched. After all the... Hey, Triple H! No, oh, the King plants his opponent! And he counters out. Triple H nearly had him. Oh, man, a huge jaw-jacking drop kick. Oh, the longer Orton's in control of this match, the more dangerous it becomes. Orton with a fiendish counter. He's left the ring. This could get interesting. And he's checking under the apron for something that can aid him in his no disqualification match. Hear it. Oh, my gosh, he stopped it. Man, I thought he was done for. Oh, that chair shot landed. The attack on the skull continues. Has enough been done to force them to quit? What? Why did he stop the ref? He must not be done with him yet. Orton 
Orton trapped him. And here is the opportunity to quit if they've had enough. who are capable of saying the words, I quit. Reversal! Horton reversed it! And the game gets taken down. Triple H heading to the top one more time. Ah, big time mistake there. Big time. Whoa, watch out. The announce table is getting torn down. Triple H with the arm. You can see the mind turning. You have to wonder what Triple H has in store next. Goes behind. Shot. Hey, that was nuts. That's debatable. No, it isn't. You can't just go around hitting people like that and think you can get away with it. You can in this match. Backdrop, and that was a nasty landing. This has been a war. Triple H looking for some big impact. This is sick. This is completely uncalled for. There are so many ways that Triple H can dissect an opponent. Triple H. Oh, big DDT. These superstars are so unpredictable. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. Triple H isn't able to finish it off. Steel and flesh meet once more. He's getting tenderized right now, like a big chair landing again. Oh, that should do it. I mean, how much punishment do you have to do in this match? Triple H has been busted open. He's removing the turnbuckle. He may have an ego, but when you're as good as Randy Orton, you have the right to fall right into that turnbuckle. Trying to get the blood flowing to his brain. A ferocious clothesline. Just devastating. Do you see that? What an impact. After this beating, who would blame a person for quitting? And Triple H is feeding off the energy in this arena.